Yep. Yep, and now it's free. Okay, there's not enough room here. So, what is this? Hmm. From this point, if you're a fiddly, if you want to do a fiddly job, you could, I guess, do the uh, return hose. It's right here put it in beneath but I'm gonna take it off because I want to clean it the rest of the intake yeah the hoses are filling so I'm gonna take off the block it's a little block here with the return lines and the sensor Calculate the return. But it doesn't want to come off. Mm -hmm. I see. Yeah, we can slide it off. Do we have room here? I think so. Nope. Not bar barely. Nope. Still a sensor here uh, below. <sighs> so we'll pull it up a little bit. Up. And pull up the sensor. Yep, the connector. Yep. That seems to be working a bit better. Aha. But now. We still have something that's holding it, that's uh, this one, I think. But now, I guess we could slide it off. No, oh, I see, wait. I see, I see, I see. Hmm, maybe I can disconnect it with a little tool I have, it'll be easier. Nope. Nope. Yes. Nope. Yep. Let's try it. A special tool. Sorry, can't bring you guys in there. Ah, I'm clipping, lifting the retainer clips. Ah, 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 ah. Special tool saves lives. More engines, but it's okay. I'm not a lifesaver. Yep. 
maybe it's best to uh, unplug and uh, to loosen the, the turn line here. Pay attention not to drop anything in the, the intake cover. Now we can lift it off, I think. Yep, we have enough room. We can undo the fault, faulty return lines. And now we can maybe slide this one off. Yep, this is uh, the mm -mm -mm MTF. Let's uh, clean it. Put it over here so I don't forget it. I cannot forget it. Yep, that's looking rather nice, isn't it? Okay, so the gasket is still intact, that's a good one. And you see some carbon buildup, which is normal. We're gonna clean it out. Put it over here. Uh, and then let's have a, a look at what we have. The price. Yep. So here you have the timing chain. It's with the timing belt. Don't get me wrong. But you also have a timing chain. Really good engines. Chain and belt. Super good. So there's the, the two... Um, uh, the two camshafts, um, everything seems clean. The, the seals are still in there. Look. No, yeah, we're gonna clean them. Anyway, spray them with some silicon. Uh, silicon spray. Always good when you uh, mount some uh, some rubber into the engine. And these are the the return lines. We're gonna unclip them. Just uh, show you in a second. Yeah, put it over here. The image. Up. Um, so we're gonna unclip them, but we have to, to to watch out because they cannot fall in here. Else, we have to take apart the valve cover. So it's a risky job. Don't get me wrong. It's a risky job. Um, what you can do. You can put in some some um, some racks or something just to make sure like this an old an old rack used to be a pants but yeah now it's a rack so when you take this one off just make sure it's clean of course yeah yep. Put it with uh, the non-dusty sides over here. Yep. Yep. Take a screwdriver. You put it in here. If it's too big, take a little one. Your pocket screwdriver. Everyone should have one. Yep. In their pockets. 